boys and girls, welcome to Science for Life for Grade 4 Pupils. I am the Irani Narayan and today we will learn more about science. So get ready to have lots of fun because science is cool, it's awesome and it is all around us. Remember to investigate, explore and ask lots and lots of questions. Our topic today is based on temperature. By the end of this session you should 1. Define temperature. 2. Identify and name the instrument used to measure temperature. And 3. Identify substances with high and low temperature. Facts you need to know about temperature. Temperature is a measure of the hotness or coldness of things. Hot things have a high temperature and cold things have a low temperature. Temperature is measured by a thermometer and is recorded in degrees Celsius or 0 C. Here's a diagram of a thermometer. You have the bulb and there, there's a tube and on the tube you have scales and inside this tube you have a glass. A glass tube inside this tube that has a liquid and the liquid could either be mercury or alcohol. Now uh, an experiment was set up to find out the temperature of water. The materials needed to conduct this experiment were a thermometer, three containers and water. We collected water from the tap, warm water and some cold water. Okay, so here we have our warm water, our cold water and water from the tap. And also we have three thermometers, one that will be used to measure each water, the temperature of each water. If you see here, this is called the bulb, this part of the thermometer is called the bulb. This is the tube and on the tube you have the scale of measurement and if you notice there is a line of red through the tube that there is alcohol found in this thermometer. And right now it is measuring, it is measuring almost 25 degree Celsius. Now, first of all, what we're going to do, I'm just going to put my hand into the water to feel how it feels. Now, if you're going to put the, your, your finger into the warm water, how do you think it will feel? You try to do it and you, can, you could tell yourself or, or you could tell someone around you how it feels. So I'm just going to put it here. Now I cannot put my hand because it is feeling hot and I'm going, not going to put it very long. I don't want to burn myself so I could say this water here is hot, right? It feels hot. Now this water here, it's cold. And when I put my finger in, it feels cold, like it has ice inside, right? Now, we have here the tap water. How do you think it, this would feel? It feels a slight coldness, but not as cold as the cold water. Now, which type of water you think has the highest temperature? Now for us to find out that, we're going to use our thermometer to measure the temperature of the water. So this thermometer here, I'm going to just place it in the container here with the warm water. And as you could see, it's, it started, the alcohol started to move upwards. I'm going to use the second thermometer here. It's, it's at 25 degree. I'm going to put it here. I'm going to observe how the, it will move. And the third thermometer will be placed in the top water. I'm just going to give it a few seconds. And then we're going to read off the thermometer to see what happens. 
with the among with the movement of the alcohol in the water. If you're to read off the what the thermometer now, you're going to see it goes above 50 degrees Celsius. Now this thermometer is only measuring up to 50 degrees Celsius, right? The other thermometer would read a higher number, but this one takes me up to 50 degree. So the warm water goes over 50 degrees Celsius, right? You could see it here, it's over 50 degree. So the warm water, we could say it has a very high temperature, right? Let's look at the cold water now. Remember when we put it in, it was measuring about 25 degrees Celsius. If you look at it now and you could see it measures, it measures about 14 degrees Celsius. So we could say now that the temperature in cold water, it has dropped, isn't that so? So cold water, the temperature is very low. And tap water, or you could call it plain water as, as you would say, it measured 26 degree before the, the thermometer, and it is still measuring about 26 degree Celsius. So plain water, it has a normal temperature or you could say room temperature. Warm water, the temperature is very high. Cold water, the temperature is low. And top water, the temperature is normal, or you could say room temperature. So we could say hot things. Once something is hot, it has a high temperature. And cold things have low temperature. What did we learn from this lesson? Temperature is a measure of the hotness or coldness of things. Hot things have a high temperature and cold things have a low temperature. Temperature is measured by a thermometer and is recorded in degrees Celsius or a zero and a C to represent degrees Celsius. Your task for this lesson. I would like you to draw and label a thermometer. Here's an example of how it should look. Here we have the diagram of the thermometer and it also have the parts of the thermometer. Hope you enjoyed this lesson on temperature. Goodbye children, see you next time.